Hey, how you doing? It's Brian Polito, proud publisher of Coffin Comics, and today, Thursday, I'm here with the one and only... Brian Polito 2. <laughs> <laughs> well, that Brandy Sparkles, you know how she goes. So, look at we are here doing the Evil Verse prize drop, and that is every physical backer is eligible to receive what we are about to drop. We're going to take a coin, drop it in the Plinko, and it's going to land. It could land on either a Lady Death or an Empress Death preview book, and that's the only way to get these preview books at this time, unless you back the VIP reward tier, which sold out instantaneously. So, without further ado, let's pick our first lucky backer, and we're doing that by using the backer numbers of your backerness on this current Kickstarter. L I'm gonna go right from the top. Boom. 1681. So that's 1681, and we're gonna find out the first name of that lucky backer, and I'm about to drop this coin down the Plinko, the evil verse. It is? Lisa. Lisa, this is for you. Woo -woo. Go, Lisa. Go, Lisa. Noise. Lisa, you just will receive with your goodies this one and only. Cyber Lady Death Edition. These preview editions are really only available this way. It's kind of fun. Now look, if you're watching this video, maybe you have backed our campaign and you're considering add-ons. Or if you haven't backed our campaign, why should you? Well, I think you should for this reason. The Coffin Comics Value Proposition. We promise that all physical backers will receive all unlock free bonus items. And that will include this free 32 page comic book featuring pinups by the one and only Lady Death Master Monty Moore. Additionally, free US shipping and a free digital download. So without further ado, I would love to make a recommendation. And the recommendation I would like to make to you is the Empress Death t-shirt. This is featuring an image by Sun K. This is Empress Death in all her glory. Clearly this is a mock-up and not a t-shirt because it's actually just a piece of paper, but it's the closest approximation. If you've seen other of our shirts, you'll know that we do this beautiful simulated uh, simulated printing. And as an example, here is one of our former shirts. Uh, and this is actually a Sun K image. So we have this beautiful screen printed image. So that's my recommendation. Get that one. Do that. Let's uh, pick another pick person another for the Evil Verse another. prize drop, shall we? All right, we're gonna dig deep. We're gonna dig, dig deep. And we're gonna go, I found, I found. 1707. 1707 is the lucky backer. And now we're going to put the drop in. I'm going to do it way over here. Who knows where it's going to land? Boom, Empress Death. Woo! You get the cool Empress Death. So imagine Dana. this. Here she is in full color, but the background's in black and white. It's a cool little artistic effect, and it's limited to 99 copies. This is amazing. I Whoops, I'm trying. I can't. Why? 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 <laughs> So you may also be thinking, well, what else is there? May I please introduce you to the concept of the Lady Death Super Deluxe Omnibus. The Super Deluxe Omnibus is limited <clears throat> to 150 copies, features artwork by Dawn McTague, beautiful gold foil on both the book itself and the slipcase. It has the gold gilding and has gold ribbon marker. Additionally, has additional exclusive prints, but what I think might be of particular interest is a brand new middle edition signed. Comes signed by Dawn McTague, but that's not all. The actual edition on the inside front cover is a signed book plate, signed by yours truly. And this is the final edition what? of the Omnibus. <gasps> final edition, so please consider it. It's on sale at the premier price of $299, and no joke, it's going fast. So, and there's free shipping for the Omnibus? U.S. This shipping? Free U.S. shipping what? from the Omnibus. That Omnibus weighs 6.66 .66 pounds. Yes. So, you know, coffin don't play. Lift the weights. Let's do one more, shall one we? One more. One more. And here we go. I'm going to do it with my left hand because I'm ambidextrous like that. And that is... 1381. 1381 is the lucky backer. Let's find out that backer's first name before we drop this in. Chris. 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 Chris, this is for you. Here we go. Do it. I'm gonna do it over in the middle. This time. Yeah. And it's coming out to boom, lady, lady death. You're gonna get a lady death preview. Not bad, huh? Well, folks, here we are. Thursday of the campaign. More to come. More excitement. Stay tuned. And if you wouldn't be so kind, please tell a friend about this campaign or Coffin Comics in general. We appreciate it. As a small, independent, family-run company, it is your support that makes us soar. Without you, we're nothing. You're the fuel and all that stuff. I ain't kidding. You've been great. I've been Brian Polito. This has been... Brian Polito, too. Uh, no, she hasn't. And talk to you later. <laughs> 
What is up, everybody? It's your boy, Brian Polito, creator of Lady Death, and we are back to unleash the most mind-warping chapter of Lady Death's undead life, an all-new 48-page original graphic novel entitled Lady Death, Imperial Requiem. This story continues, Evil Verse Unleashed, a company-wide theme overtaking the Coffin Verse in 2023. Stranded in an alternative dystopian future Earth, where her evil persona, Empress Death, has nearly extinguished the human race, things get worse for our Lady Death. Empress Death's mission is to murder the last 999 souls on Earth and finally achieve Megadeth. It's within reach, thanks to her nefarious team of monsters, Death Force. Can Lady Death, aided by the super heroic team, The Trust, conquer the cruelest opponent she's ever faced and overcome insurmountable odds? Or will Empress Death be victorious and set her murderous sights on our Earth? Lady Death's reality will be shattered as she confronts soul-crushing loss in the most heart-wrenching Lady Death story told to date. Helping me bring this latest chapter to life is our returning team of co-writer Mike McLean, illustrator Diego Bernard, colorist Cece De La Cruz, and veteran letterer Marshall Dillon. And look, here's the thing. This project is done. All we gotta do is print. But I need your help to make it happen. Please pledge now and tell everyone you know that Lady Death is back. Thank you so much, everybody. You are amazing. Later.